You've known a certain boy <laughs> since high school, and he's not the nicest. He made a habit of picking on folks, but you especially. Even still, you think he's not so bad. And when he opens up about potentially having depression and anxiety, you offer, you offer to help him with his coursework. He seems grateful, but it's difficult to tell. Maybe you'll find out how he feels tonight. Ah, <laughs> uh, hey, welcome to the post-midterm rager. <laughs> nice to have you. Mindy, good to see you. Hey, May. Oh, is that Rex trying to grump in the back? How the hell are you? He crosses the room but stops when he spots you. <laughs> Dork. What the hell are you doing here? Wait, are you asleep? How are you asleep? The music is as loud as it can go. <laughs> hey, come on, sit up, you dork. You can't just sleep here. He rolls his eyes and sets his cup aside. Ah, of course, they're sleeping in the middle of a party. Freaking nerds. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna get them to one of the guest beds. Dylan, I'll keep an eye on them, and yes, no funny business. I got it. Come on, nerd. Come here, let me pick you up and get you to somewhere quieter. Don't know if you drank anything, but you're going to have a migraine, so... Please, please try to get some rest. And I'm guessing you don't party a lot, so... He picks you up. And carries you off to your guest room. They feel so light. I told them they need to start eating lunch. And breakfast. Ugh, damn it. Why am I acting like this is my problem? I practically force my work on them. He sighs as he lies you down. Here, nerd. Get some rest. I'll go sit in the chair in the corner and just play on my phone or something. No chance I'm leaving you alone at a party when you're passed out. Huh? Y yeah, it's me. You awake, peep squeak? Yeah, I know you're tired. You dork. You look like you haven't slept in days. What the hell are you even doing at this party? Mark? Mark really wanted you to come? Yeah, no way in hell. I'm not leaving you alone. Yeah, these guys are my bros and all, but that doesn't mean I trust them alone with you. Pranks would be the least of your problems. They'd probably draw all over your face, and you'd wake up with a mustache and glasses. <laughs> Cuddle? Are, are you insane? I guess I do owe you for taking and taking on all my coursework. Yeah, fine. Here, let me lock the door real quick. If anybody ever saw me with you, my reputation would plummet super, super, super fast. He locks the door and flops next to you. Hard enough that you almost bounce right into his arms. Hey, be careful. <laughs> Here, the blankets look clean enough. Cuddle on up. And enjoy me being as nice as I'm ever going to be to you. You cuddle up with him. I'm glad for the built-in furnace feature for big soon soon boys. <laughs> grumpy guys do not have a built-in grumpy heater. I'm just a big guy with a lot of muscle and a massive hoodie, because I'm going to be warm. <laughs> there, arms around you, blankets is up, and I guess this feels kind of nice. Don't look at me like that, nerd. After a moment of silence, he speaks again, uncertain. Hey, um, I really appreciate you 
going to do my coursework for me. I guess the professors don't really care about legitimate excuses, such as I might have depression. I might have a whole bunch of other things. Trying to focus on anything other than sports is a nightmare, and so I, I know it's I know I know it's a lot though, and I am worried about you. Stubborn. Why won't they let me care for them back? Am I doing it wrong? Nerd, I'm serious. You've been skipping meals. I don't see you at practice much anymore. You're going to run yourself into the ground if you're not careful. They're so insistent on me not stressing. Of course, they would remember how they reacted when you admitted you might have something wrong. They practically insist on helping me, but... Why? I've always been a massive jerk to them ever since high school, but now. W what? what? We're, we're friends. God damn it. No, 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 sorry. I didn't mean to make you jump. Just thinking about our relationship. Like, trying to figure us out, you know? Not that there is in us, but I, I don't know if you want to be friends or... Uh, boy, boyfriend, or, s s just stop talking. Yep, I am all good, all good. Here, just try to get some sleep, okay? I mean, you you look like you need it. You cuddle back up with him. It's an odd sensation, but at the same time, you love the warmth coming off of his body. <sighs> they look so cute when they sleep. His brows raised, lips a little parted. <laughs> Damn those lips. Wait, wait, stop that. Stop, stop, stop looking at them like that. Are you, are you insane? I mean, no, no, don't do that. Don't be a stereotype and catch feelings for them, for this dork. But I'm not catching feelings for them as a person. No, 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 I, I, I can't put them all through that, trying to deal with me. I mean, I can't. I don't love them, do I? Ah, oh, damn it. I mean, I mean, they can't. I couldn't put them through that. I mean, I hate me. I'm the worst. I mean, why are they even hanging around me? I don't even know at this point. If you think rationally, they're going to find someone that actually deserves them. I can... Take the blow and move on. That's the best thing I can do for them, right? It, it's going to be okay, sweetheart. I'm. But 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 I'll do my best to take care of you until someone worthy comes along. Might even pick up a little less. <sighs> okay. God, why do they look so beautiful? Uh, um, dork. Oh, they've fallen asleep. I, um... I'm actually not sure what to do now. Uh, I guess when they wake up, I'll get them some food and get them out of here. They really need to take better care of themselves. Maybe they won't notice if I just... Give them a little peck. I love you, nerd. I love you a lot. Unbeknownst to them, you were awake. You felt the brush of their lips against your forehead, and you felt the sincereness in their words, knowing that they actually love you. Not knowing how to react, you pretend to be asleep, a blush crossing your face. What would this lead to?
Hello everybody, my name is A Man of Culture. If you like this video, make sure to comment, like, subscribe, consider donating as it funds the channel and everything that I do. Please, I want to give a special shout out to our lovely, lovely supporters at Patreon. Thank you, Panda, for being such a loyal supporter. Thank you, Ari, for being such a loyal supporter. Thank you, Castiel, <laughs> for being such a lovely supporter. And I just want to wish you all a great day. Remember to check out my Patreon, Twitter, Discord, everything. Donation links are in the description below. Have a great day. And remember... <laughs> oh, darling. Don't make it too easy for me. I might just break in. <laughs> and kidnapping you would be so easy.